So what's up everyone? It is your girl JLB87 here, aka Grace, and today we're gonna get into another collab video. So this is actually a three-way collab with myself, my girl, y'all already know Dion loves makeup, and Smiley Shawnee. So Dion said one of her followers told her that they'd love to see me, Smiley Shawnee, and of course Dion herself do this three-way collab video. So since we all have the Circle Local palette, we're all gonna do a look with the Circle Local palette. I've talked about Dion on my channel before. You all have seen me do collabs with Dion before, but um, Smiley Shawnee is um, new to me. I found out about her through Dion Loves Makeup, of course. Uh, she does um, a lot of the same videos I do, like when it comes to Natasha Denona and just a lot of um, luxury makeup. So if you like <laughs> that sort of content, definitely make sure you go over and check her out. I don't have to tell y'all to check out Dion. I don't tell y'all to check out Dion so many times, but still we'll check out Dion too. So they decided we need to do it according to alphabetical order. And since my name is in the middle with the G, <laughs> Dion got to do the top row. Now please keep in mind, I didn't change my row out completely. So I still have the color from the Tropic palette up here at the top. It's not supposed to be there. But I did redo the middle row since that's the row I have to use. So of course I would get the row with the boring ass shades, you know. With, with these two boring shades here. So I'm going to try to figure out what I'm going to do with life. Because literally I only, have one I only have one matte shade. And it's a cream to matte formula. This one right here, the rest of them all shimmer. So I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with life according to that. Knowing me, I'll probably just put um like this shade on the lower lash line. This is gonna be the inner corner shade. These two are gonna be my lid shade. Maybe I'll just rub this in the crease or something. I'm trying to figure out what exactly to do because I got stuck with basically the crappiest roll out of this palette. Um, but yeah, let me zoom y'all on in. I already got my base on to save time. I do have the purple from the Odin's Eye Soma 2 collection. Eye pencil lavender in the lower lash line. I'm sorry about the lawn man, but it's like, you know, I'm trying to get this done in a timely fashion. I still got to go home and grab some more stuff to film later on tonight after I take my son to the movie. So it's a lot going on here. And I meant to film something yesterday, but was tired, and so I didn't. Um, anyway, I'm going to go off camera now, get my life in order as far as these eyes are concerned, and I will come back and we'll see what's going on. Really, battery? Seriously? Okay. Hey y'all, I look, I came up with, with the colors I had to use. If you all remember, I had to use the middle row. So this is on my lower lash line. This is in my crease. This is on my lid. This is my outer V shade. And this is my inner corner shade. So that's what I came up with y'all. I'm not necessarily loving the lower lash line situation. Just because, you know, I feel like it doesn't really show up that well. But maybe it's just me. Ooh, yo, I almost put it on without I shut up on my lower chest. Now we can't be doing that. But I usually have it on before I um go put on my eyeliner but I forgot to put it on before I put on my eyeliner. Christ is averted, thanks goodness. Especially with the like mint pink shade in my crease. The last thing I need to not have eyes of primer. I mean thinking I'm gonna rock a mint crease girl. So it wasn't as difficult as I thought it was gonna be. I just prefer not to use shimmer as like out of V shades but you know in this case I didn't have a choice. So there you go. And since this is a color combination I normally do it anyway, it wasn't difficult for me to do. It was just more of not liking the fact that I only had one match to choose from. So it's like this had to be the crease color because I went over this on the inner corner. And I still felt the need to have a crease color. So this is what I'm working with. At first, I thought this was too ashy looking, but once you put the other colors on, it like you know balances itself out. It looks nice. It just looks like something I like airbrushed over the top, which I'm totally fine. This is my last eye look of the day for now. I got a couple more videos I want to do, so I'm gonna do an intro to one of the videos before I leave, and that should be good to go. But yes, yeah, so this will be working with so far, and then I have this brush with um, dust all over the top, so I'm gonna dust all over the top with it now. I just dusted the lower lash line so far. Um, now we're gonna take the blue shade and start with that on my outer V. Like I said, because it was a smooth, more satinish like one, I didn't dislike it as much as if it had been like a glittery topperish type shade trying to put in the outer V, then I'd have felt some type of way, but this worked out pretty well. And I'm quite pleased with it, so here's that. 
I guess I should be happy that, you know, it was at least my color aesthetic because if it had been like fully like more neutralish type colors, I don't think I'd be nearly as pleased with the look as I am. Now I'm gonna take the blue, sh the um, I guess greenish blue shade that I put towards the front of the eye and do that. Blend it all out here. I love that these two just blending into each other so well. And there's a nice um, blended effect without me hardly having to do any work, but I mean, like for $129, I shouldn't have to do all this work, should I? I don't think so. Mm, take a clean brush again. Dust over all of this here like so. And lower lash line like so. Looking good. Now we're gonna take the gold shade. And then pop that in my inner corner like so. And that is my finished eye look with this palette. Let's back it on up. But see, I didn't have that much difficulty. I put the bronze underneath the lower lash line off camera to save time, but so that's my look with this palette. Make sure you head on over and go check out Dion and Shani's looks. I'm sure they'll be nice. Dion gave me a sneak peek of hers and alert, it was fire. So <laughs> I'm sure you'll like her look just as much as you like my look and you like Shani's look. Make sure you go on over, check them out and subscribe. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Remember you all are diamonds. You can comment down below and tell me which three of our looks you like the best and which order. I think that'll be fun. And I'll see you guys in the next one. We all are diamonds. Be blessed, girl. Bye.